Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Jordy Kevin Owens Show, starring Kevin Owens, Jordy Epps. Somebody once told me the world is gonna roll me. I ain't the sharpest tool in the shed. She was looking kind of dumb with her finger and her thumb and the shape of an out on her forehead. the Jordy Kevin Owens Show. I'm Jordy Kevin Owens. And today, you like the increased production value from last time? It's pretty good. But anyways, tonight, my next guest is an upcoming contender at Wrestlemania. He's got a lot on the line, so we're going to ask him some pretty hard questions. Welcome, Mason. Great to be here, Jody yeah. Kevin. You got my new pedestal. I think it's pretty flashy. I think it's a pure power grab. Well, thank you. I think it's a compliment. So, anyways, how do you feel? I'll start with a good general question. How do you feel approaching WrestleMania, knowing you're the only belt on the line, but you, you got a lot of people wanting to grab it off of you? It's true. I, I've I've enjoyed having the belt. Um, it was uh, I. I almost feel like I fell into it. I was very fortunate to uh, to have this belt for as long as I've had it, and I know that no one has retained yet in the EPW, and I hope right. to be the first one. At WrestleMania, uh, that'd be a pretty big deal. Yeah, it's it's it, it would certainly be a feather in my cap, <laughs> but uh, we'll see how it goes. I'm going to give it my best. Uh, there's a lot of good contenders. I've got something that none of them have though, and that's Jeff Hutchins. It is true. That is true, it's a great asset. Now, let, I'll start going down the line of contenders. All right. How do you feel... Wait, is this like a, like a word association game? Maybe. Okay. But you, you can go in detail as much as you want. So oh, I just want to do... Let's, let's do two words. All right. Well, well, that's what you want, it's your show. All right, sure. Uh, I approve. Okay. So, first, let's try Noah Roten. Um, two animals. And the reason I say that is because his name's Noah, and I first thought of how two of each animal got on the ark. Alright. Okay, so how about um, the chairman himself, Barry Epps? <laughs> Your dad. <laughs> That's, that would be my two words. Okay. No, but I actually would like to say about Barry Epps that uh, he's a good man. And not only is he a good man, but he's a great man. And he has us in his house. <laughs> Focus. Oh, Focus is oh, my show. Sorry, Mr. Kevin Jordy Owens show. Uh, who's next? How about... How would you describe yourself? I'm just thrilled to be here. I'm... Uh, I'm just all smiles. Two words. Not, oh, this is the rule. Great fun. Great fun. Yes. All right. Okay. Now let's get to more of the series contenders. Okay. okay. Might want to. Let's do three words this time. All right. How about Derek Epps? Yeasty. Buckwheat. <laughs> Old fashioned. That's very interesting. It. it Explain. Well, this morning I ate uh, breakfast with my sister in okay. Charlotte, and uh, I looked at the menu, and there were some. Uh, it, it it said yeasty old fashioned buckwheat pancakes. All right. I immediately thought of Derek. Immediately. It's a pretty good analogy. I feel touched. Now, how about Tanner? Well, um. My, uh, a, a former pastor at my church named Grant Wittenberger, he had a kid named Tanner, 
and he once told a story about this tanner. Uh, said he like he had kind of a prideful streak in him. Like if you looked at something that was like a hundred feet tall, and be like, man, it'd be hard to climb that. And the tanner would be like, I can jump over that. And uh, I think, in addition to sharing the namesake, that uh, Tanner McDavid is one of the all-time irrational confidence like people. Just like, is he that? That's yeah. Okay. So, who do you think like? has the best chance of beating you? Um, I'm gonna say uh, that there are two possibilities. One is Tanner McDavid, because that would just make sense. Two um, is that Jeff Hutchins turns heel and takes the title from me. Interesting theory. See. So I'm not even considered a part of it. See, I'm not even a threat to you. Well, I didn't think about that. You, you come on the Jory Kevin Owens show. It's probably time to wrap this up. Mr. And Owens. you think that I'm not a threat to WrestleMania. Did someone say cut. There's no cutting on the Kevin Owens show. It doesn't cut until 